change lives, change lives, change organizations, change organizations, change the world. When we say change lives, change organizations, and change the world, we really mean it. Stanford GSB equips students to do that. You first have to start by changing yourself. Students are naturally encouraged to innovate. We tend to attract students, we tend to attract faculty who are not fearful of making mistakes. The fear is much more on missing out on opportunities. The extreme commitment to, I came to change the world, I'm going to change the world, what does that mean? My comfort zone ceases to exist. GSB encourages you to take risks. Broadens your perspectives on how to influence, how to lead. I learn to be a critical, analytical thinker. I understand the global context of management. The research and governance that we're doing, it shows up in SEC discussions, is used by companies in deciding how they design their compensation programs, how they want to structure their board of directors. This is not a school where we're simply training leaders for the domestic economy. At the GSB, I can leave virtually the whole world while standing at this place. The film director is bankers and private equity consultants. Renowned leaders from around the world, the Nobel Prize winner. It's really a transformational experience. Change lives. Change organizations. Change the world. I just expected going to a top business school that everyone was going to be super competitive with each other. It's not like that at all. Going through the leadership curriculum has really helped build my confidence and my ability to manage a high-performing team. I graduated from uh, Stanford Business School in 2002. Authentic leadership, and especially the way it's used at Stanford, being self-reflective, self-aware, and mission-driven. That ability to, to see myself and be true to myself, truly like the couple years I spent at Stanford Business School uh, have helped shape what I do as a global leader. Change lives. Change organizations. Change the world. If there was no Stanford Graduate School of Business, there'd be no Nike. It was in the entrepreneurship class that Frank Schellenberger taught that uh, I wrote the paper that really became the blueprint for Nike. The opening of the Nike Management Center represents a giant leap forward for the Graduate School of Business. Through curriculum reform, we now provide a very unique management education experience. It is experiential, it's transformative, it's individualized, personalized, and now we have the physical facility to put that in. The Knight Center really demonstrates teaching and living responsibly with concerns for sustainable design. This place is so much more than a physical facility. Uh, so here I'm standing on the edge of a town square next to the Arbuckle Cafe that abuts a community court. You can walk by at 10 o'clock at night and you will see students inventing the future in front of your eyes. Everything on campus is within walking distance of everything else. The university as a whole is a giant resource to the students. The physical space grounds us, enabling the ideas that are generated here to go way beyond the walls of the Knight Management Center. I'm really interested in entrepreneurship and innovation. Energy, a clean tech space. We work in tourism in Peru. Private equity. Combining business and medicine. Stanford GSB believes in the individual's ability to affect change. Make a difference in the lives of you know, hundreds, millions of people. The cornerstone of our new campus reads dedicated to the things that haven't happened yet and the people who will bring them up. And I think that in a nutshell captures uh, the essence of the GSB. Pursue your dream. Dream on a world scale. I can do whatever I put my mind to. Change lives. Change organizations. And change the world. Thank you.